So this is chapter two. And here sometimes the cutscene will like skip, so this part will still lag maybe for you. You want to pick up those matches from here, like this, light this up, and you want to do this all while running. And as you light up this last one, uh, the the next part will trigger. So you want to click that one, throw this to side a little bit, and run up. And for some reason, it didn't work. Did I? Yeah. Oh, yeah. I forgot one candle. Sorry. Then you click the window. You cannot skip this cutscene. Hey, and now you, you will jump on the table by holding A and space, and then you want to jump over it. Uh, sometimes you won't hit it. It's quite a bad jump, really, but it can be made easier by pressing crouch. So we want to. Hold shift, run, and as you press space, you will also press C like tiny little while after it, so like this. And then you obviously want to cancel the crouch again. Where the hell go? Here you jump over this. You can do it with C too, but it won't help. And as you're approaching this door, you will just tap it and you can run around this and just spam left click and then skip the custom it doesn't really save any time but well it kind of saves time because you don't have to it's on the way like then you drag this obviously take the thing that i took you cut it and you can notice that i walked back it is basically a little bit faster and then you just rotate this and that's all you have to do. And after it gets to torture, you just spam Q and you run back. If you didn't play the game casually, just there will be jump scare. Oh. This is kind of bad because I cannot go through here and I cannot go through here. I could uh, jump with C, which is possible, but basically what you want to do at the start, you want to pull it really well, so uh, basically you want to flip it like that and that's, I don't know how that happened. So you want to go here, open the door, and as you're opening things just uh, holding shift and going further, like here I'm not moving at all and I move my mouse across the entire table you can see how it's slow if I just take a step back it's so much faster and if I take a step back with sprint it's even faster uh, here you can just pull it to the side or you can actually do curb jump I will talk about curb, curb, curb jumps later and they are going to be very important. So you cut this again. And also with that door. Uh, you don't want to... Uh, as you're opening it, you don't want to bump into it. You want to rotate your mouse to left. To, to right, I mean. So that it opens before you hit it. It's quite hard but I mean it's not hard but it's it's not like going to work every time then you go here you just click this and turn around and click here you can I usually spam the first click and then I do it in the rhythm that that it suggests you to do you have to click on this and they then take the scissors or cutter and go back. 
Um, and then you got this. I actually probably won't be able to tell you all the jump scares if you don't know the game. Probably play it first. And then you take the lantern, you take the key and turn around and go forward and just skip the cutscene. And that is chapter 2.